Hello, uh, my name is Amy and I have an Instagram handle over at My Rustic House where I share home decor um, because it's a passion of mine. And I am here today in collaboration with LNC Home to show you some of my favorite lights from them that I have actually in my home. So I'm gonna do like a little small home tour and kind of discuss why I chose the lights that I did and show you how they look in my space. So as you walk into my home, this is the entryway on one side. And of course I have my um, patriotic 4th of July decor up. This is um, one side and then this is the other side. And then when you walk straight in, you see the light and this light is just so pretty. I'm gonna turn it on and show you what it looks like lit up. Isn't it so pretty? I absolutely love it. And I will try and get close to show you. Um, it is wood beads with little um, clear crystals in between it. And it's got the little wood ball. I absolutely love it. It adds such a nice little farmhouse touch to this space. We moved into this house about three years ago. It'll be three years in October. And I, you know, you want to put your own stamp on, on your new place. And um, all the lighting was original and hadn't been changed. And so well, I, my entryway is what people see when they first walk in. And I kind of wanted something more my style, with, which is like a rustic farmhouse vibe. And this was perfect. I just love it. And I think it flows really nice with all my rustic decor. I to be cabinets. My chicken stools. And I'll show you from this angle. It's just such a nice um, piece. It makes a statement without being too bold, and it just blends really nice with my decor. Like I said, I love it so much. Let me get you a little closer. And then I'm going to show you my other light and if you have any questions about anything you see please feel free to message me over at my rustic house I'll be more than glad to um, answer any questions or source anything for you like I said love my little entryway bench with some cute pillows and a crock and a store. So do you see why I chose that light? I knew I wanted it to blend in with everything in here and it really does. All right now we're gonna go into this room. This is what I call my boy room. Um, this is where my boys like to play video games but I also decorated to my taste. So it's like my second little family room. And I just love it so much. Got little chippy pieces everywhere. If you hadn't noticed, I love chippy furniture, vintage items. I love to use vintage items in unexpected ways. And I love plants. So this room gets a lot of use and it's very cozy. I really love it. But um, I don't have an actual light in here. I have a ceiling fan. So I couldn't replace that. I live in the South and we need these ceiling fans because it gets really hot pretty much April through October. <laughs> so we like to have our ceiling fans. So I do have lamps in here. I'm going to show you my dining room, and that is where I put my second piece from LNC Home. And it is right through there. Let me show you a couple other little pieces. You see it? Isn't it gorgeous? That piece. I'm going to get a little closer and show you. This wooden octopus chandelier is my favorite. 
I fell in love with it the moment I laid eyes on it in on the website. And let me tell you why I chose it. Okay, if you see this room, I have a lot of vintage pieces, um, but I, I'm also kind of a neutral person. I have a little bit of neutral colors. I keep it neutral. So I wanted a piece that would blend in, look rustic, look vintage, but also look a little elegant at the same time, just because I have so many vintage rustic pieces, um, I needed to add a little bit of sophistication. And this truly does the job. Let me show you up close. Do you see like the patina of that? And then the wood. I absolutely love it. I think it's rustic and elegant all at the same time. It looks vintage, even though it's not. Um, this, what was in here before was just something kind of darker and heavier and a little too formal for my taste. It was very easy. My husband and I replaced this just in a, an hour or two. Um, I did have to purchase the lights, the light bulbs, which that was easy. And I'll turn it on for you and show you what it looks like. And I'll kind of go through the different angles in here and show you. But for now, I could not be more happy with it. It's absolutely beautiful. Let me go turn it on for you. I love it. Just add such a nice touch in here with all my vintage pieces and my plants. I'll show you the kelp and turn the light back on for you there. It's just some natural light. And like I said, I love vintage. I collect so many fun little pieces and I love to display them. And so I just wanted something that would blend in nicely and look really elegant. And I feel like that this um, chandelier really does the job. And see it from this angle. It's perfect. And then I'll show you from this angle. Sorry, I am squeezing through. It blends in just with everything. And like I said, if you have any questions, don't hesitate to message me and I will add, I will source anything for you. But like I, most of my pieces are vintage. So I shop at vintage, shores, vintage stores, vintage shops, flea markets, thrift stores, um, so many other places, Facebook Marketplace. There's just a lot of fun places to find things like that. I'm just still, every time I walk into this space, I smile when I see the light. And I was actually surprised at how light and airy it made the room feel when once I got it up. Just because the light I had was so thick and bulky and dark, and it really wasn't my style. So this one, I was surprised at what a huge difference it made. It actually really did surprise me because I'm like, oh, lighting, it's great, but lighting truly does make a difference. So if you're um, in the market for new lighting, they had some amazing chandeliers, and I did a blog post of some of my favorite lights on their website. Um, if you want to check that out and see some of the other ones. It was a toss-up between this one and one that had like, this part was like a black color. I thought that would have looked nice and blended in well. But um, I'm glad I chose this one just because the lightness of it really makes this room feel super airy and bright. And I'm gonna show you a couple little areas where I kinda wanna change out the lighting and maybe I'll get to that at some point. But like I said, right now, these are the two I have and they are amazing. And I couldn't be happier with the quality um, and the customer service. They were both really, really nice. 